moved to Muscle Shoals, I worked with a lot of different guys. And <clears throat> one of the guys I, it took me a long time to work with was Mr. Rick Hall here, who uh, produced everything under the sun down there. He put that little cotton patch on the back. And I did my little producer apprenticeship under Rick. And, and Mac is my songwriting guru, so uh, I'm going to play one that Mac and I wrote that Rick and I produced. <laughs> So interesting musically there. For, for me, uh, 
Well, my dad used to sit around on the porch and play guitar. He only knew three chords. Anytime he would come to one he didn't know, he would take his hand off the guitar and whistle. <laughs> when I started writing songs, he would, he would try to carry along with me as, long, as far as he could, but he had to whistle a pretty good bit. Uh, he always was after me to write a simpler song, write one that wasn't so, you know, didn't have so many whistling chords in it. And, uh, <laughs> It was, it was actually after he was gone that I was thinking about it, and I was trying to think of something that I would write that, that maybe he could have played. And, uh, and, and I came up with this little thing about farming. It's, uh, it's something, the last couple of generations, I think, were so money-oriented, we sort of forgot what a noble endeavor it is to drop a seed in the ground, tend to it, and share the fruits of what comes out of it. And uh, that's sort of what this song's about.
Did anybody see uh, Nashville Life magazine today? Well, Dan was voted one of the 100 coolest guys in Nashville. Oh, that's what they call it all here. It's like that song. Sweet inspiration. Unfortunately, a lot of times the creative people in between the process. There are those times when you hear something that you, you know has been really uh, treated carefully. And all those guitar licks that you worked so hard on were uh, paid attention to, which was the case on, on this song. And I think a big part of the reason for that was that Mac played the guitar on it. Yeah. <laughs> dark alone, the three of us again. You and me are right here, with your memory of him. You say I lost my mind, but you say that every time. Feel you hold it in, just as close as me. Touch your face. 